Now let's turn to the world of daytime. Soap Opera Digest editorial director Stephanie Sloan joins us. Stephanie, so good to see you. Let's start with Judith Chapman returning to The Young and the Restless. So Judith hasn't been at the show for two years, so she admits that she was surprised when she got the call. She was told to keep it under wraps, which she did mostly, but said she had to tell her mother who needed some good news. Judith admits that she was initially overwhelmed by all the coronavirus protocols in place, but once she got into wardrobe and got her hair and makeup done, everything was fine. Judith tells us that she really missed seeing everyone and was so happy to reconnect with her TV sons, Greg Rickhart and Christian LeBlanc, and says that they didn't miss a beat, and the minute they started working together, it was like they just saw each other yesterday. And speaking of y &R, you also caught up with Michelle Stafford and Joshua Morrow to talk about their relationship. So they tell us that they both knew that the pairing of Nick and Phyllis could really upset the longtime fans of Nick and Sharon, but once Nick and Phyllis got together, their chemistry could not be denied. Joshua says he remembers the first story as being really hot. He says it's one of his favorite triangles to date. Michelle says she knows that soap fans are the best, and whether they like something or hate something, at least they're really passionate about it, and she wasn't worried about their reaction. The two are happy to be working together again and say there's a lot more to come for this duo. All right, thanks so much, Stephanie. We'll be sure to check out the latest issue of Soap Opera Digest.